Hi guys, welcome back to Newcastle Fans TV. We're here to give you some news. <gasps> Kyle's done a lot of work behind the scenes and we have arranged a five-a-side match because 11 aside, we're not exactly fit for that at the minute. Um, a five-a-side match against... <laughs> well, Who is against? Who's it against? We'll do a little drum roll. Three, two, one. Derby Day, next Sunday, the 17th of November at Eldon Leisure Centre, 12 o'clock kickoff for Newcastle Fans TV against SASC Fan TV. It's Derby Day, gents, and um, I think we're all looking forward to it, aren't we? I am, actually, because it's a close to a derby that we've had in quite some time. Yeah, yeah, I've, I've, went, I've, went for the, I've, I've went for derby. <laughs> There's one dislike. I, I, I've, went, I've went for... No, we'll already get one anyway, don't we? But... Uh, <laughs> It's it's going to be nice. I've I've uh, been speaking with um with the the lads at SCFC Fan TV and organising everything, and I can tell you, it's, um, I know in the past we've had problems organising things, but I can tell you, it's been the it's been it's been a cakewalk. Um, actually, organise. Yes, it's been very easy to organise this. So, um, seventeenth of November, twelve o'clock, five aside. Where are you playing, Johnny? Where am I playing? Well, it's up to a certain manager. <laughs> yes, admit, that's. You know? Mr. Paul Rutter. So he was commentator against Borough Fan TV, which we won 2-1. But this one, it's a bigger game. Of course, it's a bigger game. It's Newcastle versus Sunderland. He's also the cheerleader as well. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. So, look, Paul's going to be the manager. Um, we're going to get, you get, get a little video. Stream, you can get yeah. Paul is going to be your utility guy. Paul's got a little reaction to being manager for Newcastle Fans TV against the Markhams, against SEFC Fan TV. Paul, take it away. Some people have been saying in the comments that I'm too Rafa, that I've got Rafa tainted glasses on. Oh, gee. I just don't know where to get this from. I really, really don't. Come the weekend, a Newcastle fans TV v Sunderland fans TV, I'm going to bring a little bit of the Rafa esque philosophy to the touchline, and I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to Newcastle fans TV smashing. The absolute livings out of Sunderland Fans TV, just like we did with our friends from further down the A19 down at Middlesbrough and Middlesbrough Fans TV. We're looking to make it a North East double this Sunday. Cheerleader, manager, fans, I'll do the lot. But for those who think I'm too Rafa oriented, come on, man. No, can can we can we win? Five aside, we've we've got it booked for an hour. It's survival of the fittest, mate. And uh, Des and Troy are here. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I, I I regret doing that now. But yeah, Especially yeah. For lose, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> but oh, come on, we're not gonna we're not gonna lose. You know, we, we've got Paul as manager. I, I trust his tactics. I've got good tactics of my own that never fail at five aside when I when I played it regularly. Lee, seven players have been confirmed to be in, uh, in part for this match. Yourself, Rob, Kyle, myself. Um, we've also got Rob Rubenstein and Ramsey. So we've got six, not seven. Apologies. We've got six I think we've got guaranteed. One more. I think we've got one more coming in. I don't know. One more confirmed. We might, maybe. A maybe. We'll get deadline one. Deadline day. Transfer deadline day. Definitely. Deadline day. We'll get. We'll make sure that's on all our socials as well. We might do a set. Maybe include this in the video if something happens from now till then. But yeah, six definitely confirmed. We have got a, a sev seventh player hopefully on the horizon as well. But Lee... It's just another thing that we like to do. We like to do something a little bit different for the channel. You know, you like to, you know, try and make make things happen. At this cha uh, this channel leading the way. That's what I like to say. It's just good news all around, isn't it? Regardless of what the result is. Well, thankfully, I've done knee organising, so thank you very much, Kyle. Mm -hmm. so, no problem. Because um, obviously, I've got enough on me plate with what what I do. So um, I'll just say, Kyle, it's all yours. Go and do whatever you want to go and do. And he's done it. Um, I checked the venue out. It looks good for the stream as well. So fingers crossed that goes well. Um, it's not for charity. However, uh, if this does go well, we might look at it next summer and build in something bigger like we did with Borough Fan TV, which was a great success in terms of the stream and the money that we raised. Not so much of the organising, so well done, Kyle. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to it. It should be good fun. Newcastle versus Sunderland. Who would have thought you'd get it this season anyway? Um, yeah, if you want to come along, it's Eldon Leisure Centre, which is in Eldon Square. If you if you're familiar with Newcastle, if you know where the Nando's and the Starbucks is, towards all the restaurants, it's the second level. That's how you need to remember. So if you're if you're not too sure, just think of where all the restaurants are, the fish and chips. Just message uh, message a Facebook page, and I'll be Yeah, Facebook page, Twitter, Instagram. You know where to follow us, even on the YouTube comments. We're all involved in the comments as well. So, yeah, Elden Leisure Centre, if you want to get there for me, quarter to 12 to support the lads. 
hopefully we'll help these out. Um, but if you can't, if you can't make it, well, there will be a stream available as well, and hopefully Newcastle will get the win. My thanks to. To, I was going to say Paul there, but Paul's manager. <laughs> that, <laughs> that was a garbage bit of uh, presenting there, I should say. But yeah, my thanks to Lee, to Kyle, and to Rob. Newcastle Fans TV versus SAFC Fan TV. It's Derby Day this Sunday. Don't miss it. People keep asking me about the starting eleven. You'll have to wait and see. <laughs>